Hi buddy, welcome back to Answers Q. In this video, we'll see some free courses that are offered by IBM for students to develop their tech skills. So before we see that, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, kindly do that first. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon that appears after that. So you'll get a notification whenever we upload a video like this. And you can also join our Telegram channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. I'll give you all the link in description, do check it out. And just a small update regarding Coursera here. So I hope you all know about Coursera. It's a very good e-learning platform where you can get courses from top companies and universities like Google, Amazon, IBM or Duke University and a lot more leading universities and companies are offering courses via Coursera platform. So if you want to purchase any course in Coursera, instead of buying that single course, you can opt for Coursera plus subscription because with the subscription, you'll get unlimited access to 7000 plus world class courses. And not only that, you'll also get job ready certificate programs and guided projects. So if you are interested in this, just check out the link in description for Coursera plus subscription. So now let's move on and see the free courses that are offered by IBM for students. So first let us see what are the different topics across which they are offering courses. So when it comes to technical skills, these are the categories under which they are offering courses. IT support, web development, artificial intelligence, cloud computing, blockchain, cybersecurity, data science, quantum computing and emerging technologies. So these are the different topics under which they are offering courses when it comes to technical skills. And similarly, IBM is offering some free courses for students to develop workplace skills. Uh, so you can get courses on different uh, topics like agile, design thinking, mindfulness, job readiness and the professional skills. And apart from this, there are two more topics like sustainability and principles of design. So you have courses across all these different topics in IBM now. So from this list of topics, you can just choose any one topic uh, that you find interesting. For example, if you want to take web development courses, simply choose web development here and then you'll be directed to a page like this and here just click on this start learning button that you see here and then you will be directed to another section which will be looking something like this. And here simply click on the sign up because we need an account in this platform. So you can use your Google account or LinkedIn account to create your account in this platform or else you can simply click on the sign up with email and then you'll be directed to another section like this. So here simply click on sign up and fill the details manually and click on sign up and create your account in this platform first. So the first step is to create account and log into it. So let me just log into my account and catch up after that. So now I have logged into my account and we chose the web development learning path. So you can see here there are seven courses in this particular learning plan. So zero out of seven complete, which means seven courses are there. You can see here what are those seven courses as well web development basics, developing sites for web, introduction to HTML, CSS, bringing websites to life with JavaScript, or website testing and deployment, and there are two more courses. So here you can see what are the courses, and if you just scroll down a bit, you can see here the task which you need to complete, and you can get a, a digital credential, which is basically, basically like a batch, uh, which will look something like this. So you can get this badge and you can just share this in your resume. You can also share it in your LinkedIn as well. So now you can simply choose the course and start learning or you can just go with the first course in the list. So once you click on the course, you'll be directed to the course info page. So you can simply click on this, go to this activity. So you can see here a blue button, just click on it and it will take you to the learning area. And before that, uh, you will see something like this. So just click on agree, just to agree to their terms and conditions. So once you do that, you are good to go. You can just start learning. You can simply click on the start course and start learning for free. So this will be the first course in your learning path. And if you want to know what you learn in a course, you can simply scroll down and see here the modules. So you'll get to know what they are going to teach you and what you can learn from the course which you choose. So if you scroll down a bit, you will see here final assessment, which means at the end of the course, you need to take a final assessment. And after that, you can get your course completion batch. So once you complete the first course, you can move on to the next one. There are seven courses, courses in this particular learning plan. So this is just for web development. Uh, like we saw earlier, there are many more subjects like IT support, artificial intelligence, cloud computing, blockchain, data science. So you can choose anything and you can just learn for free using this platform. I hope you'll find this useful. If you want to get more updates about online courses, do subscribe to AnswersQ and press the bell icon so that you will get a notification whenever we upload a video like this.